we are headed to Wheatsfield, our local co-op. It's so cute to see the differences in these kids. Like Sean loved to suck on his thumb and uh, hold his ear. And this kid loves to hold on to a blanket and suck his thumb. It's really cute. Okay, this is awesome. I'm actually learning how to record my screen and figuring out how to do a few things here. And I thought this was cool. So um, Wheatsfield, I said Wheatsfield, this is the store in Ames that I used to sell duck eggs to commercially when we owned all those ducks. And now um, they also offer this community room, which I'm going to uh, show you a picture of, but I saw in their community room this mirror that they had when they were doing uh, shows for their cooking, like little cooking shows that they would line up the tables and have people be able to see into the pot while cooking um, through this. And I thought, wow, this would be fantastic if I was able to do more cooking shows and was able, more cooking tutorials, but in a more easy flow manner. And I thought that would be a really good idea. And that isn't even a mirror mirror, that's mylar. It's like the inside of a balloon when you pop it, the ones that are like kind of not stretchy, that's a mylar. And it's got like this mirror um, quality to it. So uh, it's really light and easy to put up and you can just buy mylar and, and get it on a frame and use it and it's it's like a mirror. We had a huge one that was given to us, so we had it for a while before it got destroyed. Um, well, we put it in the kids' room, so that would happen. Uh, anyway, and I just got this effect. I just love being able to video uh, record my screen. Okay, here on the library floor, I thought that I saw a squash bug but there's a difference between a stink bug and a squash bug. Stink bugs are, the, that. here's a squash bug, those little stinkers that ruin your, your all of your squash plants. And, um, and there is a stink bug. So, uh, squash bugs, stink bugs. So the stink bugs are more round and the squash bugs are more, they look a little bit more like a box elder bug. I feel like I see those guys too. I don't know, what do stink bugs eat even? What do stink bugs eat? Stink bugs eat a diet consists of mostly entirely leaves. They're strictly herbivores and eat the leaves of low really abundant foliage. Wow, there are 3,000 species of stink bugs. Each one has a preference for leafy meals. Well, what is it doing inside of the library? What is it doing inside the library? I do not know. Um, just seeking a warm area things can go without eating for a very long time and then they can get outside when it starts to warm up or they can probably hibernate or something they can go dormant for a long time but anyway thought that was interesting thing i was thinking of do they wreak havoc in the garden and it says yes while the stink bugs aren't the most common garden pests they can still wreak havoc to any garden the females will lay their eggs on any kinds of plants that happen to be around with both larvae and adults feeding on the plant juices because i thought man i've seen stink bugs there and they both yes. both squash bugs and stink bugs she's getting into my wallet both squash bugs and stink bugs actually um emit this kind of stink when smashed. So, well, what an appropriate little shirt to be wearing, Jace. My little stinker. My little stinker. 